Hello, welcome to the Mark Janot Show, the cybersecurity show. In this video, I'm gonna talk about free cybersecurity training for beginners. I'm gonna talk about the platforms that will make you really in high demand because of the precise skill set needed to really maximize your career in this industry. So without further ado, let's get right into it. We're going dark. Let's talk about the essential series. You know, there's the, I'm gonna provide an overview of the ethical hacking essentials, the digital forensic essentials, and the network defense essentials, right? They are foundational courses. However, each of these courses comes with an optional hands-on lab upgrade. So now let's get into it. Let's talk about the ethical hacking essentials. So with this free cybersecurity course, you will gain strong foundations in ethical hacking and penetration testing that will help create your pathway to an entry level career in cybersecurity. Now let's give you an overview of what that's about. There's 12 learning modules. There's the official e-courseware. There's 15 plus hours of premium self-paced video training. There's 11 lab activities in a simulated lab environment, which is an optional add-on. Now, core modules, the information security fundamentals, ethical hacking fundamentals, information security threats and vulnerabilities. And uh, before I proceed, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and the like button. Please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and the like button. We then have the password cracking techniques and countermeasures. And then uh, we have social engineering techniques. That is a big one. Social engineering is one of the most common cyber attacks in the industry, in multiple industries. Uh, next, we have the network level attacks and countermeasures. We have web application attacks, wireless attacks, mobile attacks, and IoT and OT attacks and countermeasures. Some of the tools that you're going to be using is the SQL injection tool, Netcraft, uh, the web application security scanner, and the ARP spoofing detection tools. So now let's get into the network defense essentials. So with this free cybersecurity course, you will build a strong foundation in network defense and information security facets that can help you prepare for a career in cybersecurity. So this specific uh, course highlights the fundamentals of network security and protocols, network security controls, understanding identity and access management and more. There are 12 learning modules and official e-courseware, 14 plus hours of premium self-paced video training, 11 lab activities in a simulated lab environment. Some of the course modules, we have network security fundamentals, identification, authentication and authorization, network security controls like administrative controls, network security controls like physical controls and technical controls. We have mo mobile device security, IoT device security, cryptography and PKI, data security, network trafficking, <laughs> trafficking, network traffic monitoring. And some of the tools that you will learn and use is the Docker Bench for security, AWS, Mirado MDM, a hash kale and MD5 calculator. So lastly, we have the digital forensics essentials, and that is the, you know, it was designed to help beginners grasp the, fun the foundations of digital forensics with hands-on skills and validate their knowledge as information security professionals. This free cybersecurity course will teach learners the steps and practices and me uh, methodologies to follow during a digital forensics investigation. So there are 12 learning modules and official e-courseware, 11 plus hours of premium self-paced video training, 11, 11 lab activities in a simulated lab environment, which is an optional add-on. And then we have course modules. We have the computer forensic fundamentals, computer forensics investigation process. Next, we have understanding hard disk and file systems and data acquisition and duplication. Next, we have defeating anti-forensic techniques. Next, Windows forensics. Next, Linux and Mac forensics. Next, network forensics. Next, investigating web attacks. Next, dark web forensics. Next, investigating email crime because dark web is a huge portion of cybersecurity. And then next, we have malware forensics. Now let's get into some of the tools that you're gonna use. You're gonna use Linux, Windows, SleuthKit, Wireshark, Splunk, Tor Browser, and the Asset Database View. You're gonna be using those. Uh, me personally, Wireshark and Linux are a big one, I think, for this. So that's what I have for you today. Please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and the like button. Once again, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and the like button. I appreciate your viewership. I appreciate your support. Please like, comment, share this content. Stay safe. See you on the next video.